In this video, we are going to discuss a good question based on sum of series. So the question is, we need to find the sum of the series. And the series is given as root of 1 plus 1 by 1 square plus 1 by 2 square plus root of 1 plus 1 by 2 square plus 1 by 3 square and so on till under root of 1 plus 1 by 2007 square plus 1 by 2008 square. So, we have to find some fine. Karna hai. Now, see, this initially seems to be a very complicated question, but what can we do? First of all, first of all, let us find out the number of terms. Number of terms, how do we find? Karenge? See, the first term is, so in the middle, we have 1 here, right? Second term, we have 2 here. In this way, we can say that since it is 2007, so the number of terms in the series is 2007. This is the first point. हमने सबसे पहले जो नंबर ऑफ टर्म्स है वो देखिए कि कितने हैं राइट नाउ लेट अस फोकस ऑन दिस पर्टिकुलर रूट दिस इज 1 1 by 1 एंड 1 by 4 सो दिस इज बेसिकली 1 plus 1 by 1 plus 1 by 4 प्लस दिस इज अंडर रूट ऑफ 1 plus 1 by 4 plus 1 by 9 प्लस द नेक्स्ट वुड बी अंडर रूट ऑफ 1 plus 1 by नाउ इट वुड बी 3 स्क्वायर प्लस 1 by 4 स्क्वायर सो इट वुड बी 1 by 9 plus 1 by 16 एंड सो ऑन and this series is going till the last term is 1 plus 1 by 2007 square plus 1 upon 2008 square. Okay, this series is going Right. Now, if we solve this, so this is nothing but I think this will become 9 by 4. The root. Root of 9 by 4. This will become, we are just solving this, right? Taking LCM. So, this will become... Uh, I think 49 and niche aega, the LCM will be 36. Fine. Thik hai. This is the way. If we solve the root, so that will be uh, 69, 144. So 169 over 144. And so on. And our last term would be under root of 2007 square into 2008 square. This is our LCM. And what is the numerator? We will not fail in the numerator. Let it be uh, some number x. ठीक है उसको need solve uh, करने की need नहीं है कुछ इसलिए हम उसको x ले लेते हैं right अब देखिए जब हम यहाँ पे solve करते हैं तो this will this is nothing but three by two this is seven by six this is thirteen by twelve and so on तो आप देखेंगे जो भी numerator आ रहा है वो denominator से one ज़्यादा है ठीक है यहाँ पर two था यहाँ पे six था यहाँ पे twelve था and so on this is the last term okay which is under root of x over 2007 into 2008. You know that the 2007 into 2008 is going to come. So what will happen? Every term of the denominator is one more than the term, right? The denominator. So I think the numerator in this particular term must be 2007 into 2008 plus 1. Whatever it is, you don't need to solve it. But this is going to come. And this will not be the root. So let me write it properly once. So the numerator using the same logic, right? So numerator जो आएगा वो क्या आएगा? Just a second. Hmm. So the numerator will be 2007 into 2008 plus one. ठीक है? Now see, we can split this three by two. We can write this as one plus one by two, right? This can be written as one plus one by six. This can be written as 1 plus 1 by 12, right? Or usi tarah se, hum is term ko kya lik sakte hain? 1 plus, last term ko 1 plus 1 upon 2007 into 2008. Jo bhi dono ka predict aar hai. Thik hai? Ab ye 1 kitni times aayin hain 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 hain? Her term se, hum ko ek baar 1 mil raha hai. And since we have already discussed this, ki there are number of terms is 2007. So 1 hum ko 2007 times mil gaya hai. Okay, and the remaining series now that we have is 1 by 2 plus 1 by 6 plus 1 by 12 and so on. And the series is going till 1 by 2007 into 2008. Now this part is quite easy. 1, 1, 1, 1, 2007 times that equals 2007. Fine. Now see, for this part, what we need to do is this 1 by 2 can be written as 1 minus 1 by 2. You can check this. This 1 by 2 can be written as 1 minus 1 by 2. This 1 by 6 can be written as 1 by 2 minus 1 by 3. If you solve it, then 1 by 6 will come. Right? This 1 by 12 can be written as 1 by 3 minus 1 by 4. 
कि कैसे हमको स्ट्राइक करना चाहिए सी दिस टू इज प्रोडक्ट ऑफ टू कॉन्जिव नंबर दैट इज वन एंड टू सिक्स किस किस का प्रोडक्ट है टू और थ्री का ट्वेल्व थ्री और फोर का तो बेसिकली जो डिनोमिनेटर में हमारे पास है वो कॉन्जिव नंबर के प्रोडक्ट है इसलिए हम इनको इस फॉर्म में लिख सकते हैं एंड दिस रीज विल गो ऑन एंड द लास्ट टर्म विल बी वन थाउजन अपॉन टू थाउजेंड सेवन माइनस वन अपॉन टू थाउजेंड एट फाइन तो ऑल दीज मिडिल टर्म्स विल कैंसिल आउट हमारे पास कौन कौन सी टर्म बचने वाली है केवल फर्स्ट टर्म और लास्ट टर्म तो फाइनली वी हैव टू थाउजेंड सेवन प्लस वन माइनस वन ओवर टू थाउजेंड एट विच कैन बी रिटर्न एज टू थाउजेंड एट माइनस वन ओवर टू थाउजेंड एट so the correct answer to this question is option a that is 2008 minus 1 upon 2008 so i hope this question is clear to you thank you